Hey everybody, Chief Meteorologist Brad Penovich. It is pouring right now in most of the Charlotte metro area, and we've had some flash flood advisories and flood warnings for parts of the area, and that's probably going to be the biggest issue we're going to deal with today. Also lightning, but the lightning actually, you know, unless you're outside, is not going to be an issue. But you can see we've got plenty of moisture <laughs> falling out there right now. Um, you can look at the view here, and it's pretty much raining just about everywhere. Um, and these are slow moving downpours. So expect the rain to be really intense for short bursts of time one two three inches of rain per hour but a pretty big cluster is over us right now and you can see this this is kind of moving off to the northeast to the east and to the west not a lot going on in fact let me show you the wider view here um, you could see there's a stalled front to the north but on either side it's this main band so as we go through the afternoon um, we'll likely see these surges of moisture then a break for several hours and then another surge it does look like a little disturbance if you look carefully you will see a little bit of spin here there's a low pressure or meso low or something that's going to track through that's going to come through this evening and likely kick off a secondary wave of showers and storms so this is kind of what we expected today it wasn't going to be a complete washout but if you're under the rain whew, it is coming down like it is right now across the area so let me quickly show you a, a quick future cast for the rest of the day so we'll focus hyper short term here. We'll make this quick. This is an 18 hour future cast. So you can see the heavy rain over us now between now and 11 a.m. Uh, it's about one o'clock. Uh, it starts moving into the mountains and foothills. So folks north are going to see that heavy rain. And then three, four, five o'clock, there's going to be more breaks. The storms and showers will be more isolated in nature. Um, but as we get closer to the dinner time hour, we could see two distinct waves of rain. It looks like one maybe kind of east where the sun has been out most of the day and one to the west. We'll have to see if these storms this morning kind of ease things up in the middle because that would actually keep the, the risk of stronger storms away if we use up some of the fuel this morning, which is distinctly possible. But I'd still expect another wave of rain this evening. We go to our 7, 8, 9 o'clock and you can see, yeah, that second wave forms around 9 o'clock um, through about 10 o'clock and then moves through. So... Um, there's definitely going to be a second surge at some point later this evening or tonight after this morning's batch. And this is an 18-hour loop just to kind of show you. And you can almost see that little low kind of moving through. So this is what we expect. Some of you haven't seen a drop of rain yet. Others have seen two to three inches of rain. That's just the way it's going to go today. So just have a weather plan. Stay weather aware for flash flooding and lightning as we go through the afternoon.